Hello people of YouTube and I'm back with another error and I know it's been quite a long while and I have not been uploading well I wouldn't apologize for that because 0.1% of my subscriber base is watching my videos on a regular basis and I happen to know that 0.1% so it doesn't even matter because it's all new people I'm talking to so hello new people and uh, the reason I haven't been uploading is that um, the new policy of YouTube that stated you need to get 10,000 lifetime views to earn anything or for the ads to play on your videos so that you can earn money uh, I kind of flipped out on that and it took me a while to understand why was it beneficial to anyone especially for smaller channel channels like me and uh, now I've come to an understanding and what's more I guess a few ads have already played on my videos however I have not reached that threshold yet but um, I'm happy with that and I really understand the policy now so alright with that being said let's get started on this error so this is a pretty you know brain wrecking error because there's nothing much you can do around it so what this error is that when you run the chrome setup and I don't know um, I think hardly anyone uh, uses any other browser these days I'm using Mozilla Firefox and that's because I accidentally deleted the Google folder from the C drive and I had to use this because this great installer won't run okay so since this won't run I have tried a, like a few solutions that are pretty standard and you can try them before you proceed with the advanced stuff so what I did is I right click chrome setup.exe and went to properties um, and please note that my internet connection is off my Wi-Fi is off and all this is being done offline and when in the properties tab you can go to um, details general na 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 so yeah okay all right so basically there's nothing much you can do here my apologies and um, so how do you how do you get this running so in case you had any luck by you know right clicking this and running this as administrator then you're good to go but um, if you're unlucky like me you can always go to the run window and type in reg edit registry editor and let that thing pop up all right so here it is and i want you to go to HK current user under that you need to navigate your way to software and you can just scroll down to this what the hell is this all right i'll deal with that later so you can navigate down to this folder and what you need to do is just delete it now I'm not gonna delete it or maybe I should well I don't know all right I'm gonna delete it and when you delete this you're gonna have to restart your computer 
to um, get the thing working and this works 90% of the times the rest 10% is when you're absolutely unlucky so I cannot help you with that so let's go ahead and delete it okay so with that gone you can also right after deleting that you can try running this and keep an eye out for this Google thing right here in case it adds up to your registry right now. Well, and think and to see if something is hindering um, the program from starting, you can also go to Task Manager. And here it is, here it is guys, here it is. Ah. Yes, here it is. So um, I hope you guys can trust me on this, that this is how Google install, Chrome installs itself. And I do not have any internet connection online um, to show you guys that it actually works so please bear with me trust me and if you do not trust me you can read this thing so basically if you have an internet connection on and you do not have blacklisted this google update.exe you can get this thing running and for firewall basically in windows 10 you can go to settings and you can navigate to the windows defender because most of the times that is what catches you know the bugs and stuff and most of the times it's just useless alright so since I have quick heal installed I have disabled this but um, if this hinders in the installation of Chrome you can always turn off the real time protection and try installing it again and for firewall blocking and all that stuff when you deleted that uh, folder Google folder from the registry editor it resets all those values so you can um, be certain about the solution and hit me up in the comment section if you still have any difficulties i'll try to solve them and um, tell me if it worked for you please like comment and subscribe unless youtube won't let me you know grow so like comment and subscribe tell your friends if they have the same problem and thanks for watching